Now the On Your Side forecast. Welcome back. A pretty cloudy day in Boise today as we expected with temperatures above average. We actually hit 40 degrees, but we're at 38 degrees in Boise right now. A light breeze out there. So if you're getting ready to head out to anticipate some cool temperatures, but considering for this time of year last year when we rung in the new year, it was in the teens. So generally speaking, we are warmer than average and we're going to continue that trend for the next several days. The first week of the new year, our temperatures are going to be in the 40s across the Treasure Valley and that will take us in through the weekend, so we are not expecting snow to be accumulating in the Treasure Valley, although we could see a couple of flakes flying late this evening as we get ready to ring in the new year, but that will be turning over into rain very likely through the rest of the night for the Treasure Valley. We do anticipate quite a bit of snow to be piling up in the central mountains where we have winter weather advisories now in place all the way through tomorrow night at 11 p.m. We are starting to see some scattered showers moving into some of our viewing areas. Weezer may be seeing a light snow shower in a mix of rain and snow around Ontario as well. Horseshoe Bend seeing a mix and this is going to continue throughout the evening with increased chances of precipitation as we get closer and closer to midnight and then a real soaker overnight past midnight and through tomorrow morning. That's all because of this system that is pushing that moisture on air. Seattle and uh, Washington and Oregon getting in on that moisture as well. So a very wet start to the new year for many locations across the Pacific Northwest. We'll time it out for you in the future cast, but it still looks like like midnight is when things are going to be filling in across the area. So the next couple of hours, a little spotty 10 PM is when we'll start to see a little more rain moving into the valley. So if you're heading out to celebrate, Canyon County could start seeing some rain around 10 o'clock and then by midnight that really fills in across the area. Maybe a mix of rain and snow in downtown Boise, but not expecting to stay snow very long because of those warmer temperatures tomorrow. Our snow levels are even going to be rising, so some mountain locations will be seeing rain, but a very, um, a very busy and active night tonight to start off the new year with precipitation. A lot of rain in the valley locations and scattered snow showers continue throughout the day tomorrow. That winter weather advisory will be in place until 11 o'clock tomorrow night. So generally speaking, 6 to 12 inches across higher elevation mountain locations, but snow levels will rise at some point throughout the day tomorrow. But the first 10 days of the new year look to bring continued snow to many ski resorts across the state. So we could see upwards of two feet of snow for many ski resorts, so just wanted to throw that in there. If you got a new pair of skis for Christmas or something, you'll have uh, plenty of reasons to get out there and test them out in the next 10 days or so. Meanwhile, tomorrow, wet and windy across the Treasure Valley. Temperatures are going to be warm well into the 40s. We could even see thunder and lightning at some point throughout the day tomorrow, so a little stormy to start the year. 38 degrees in Idaho City, 41 in Garden Valley, so snow turning to rain at some point. Well, we'll be right around freezing for the Long Valley, 6 to 12 inches for many mountain locations expected to accumulate tomorrow, right around freezing for Stanley with that winter weather advisory in place as well. We could see an inch or two overnight in the Magic Valley accumulating before things turn to rain with temperatures right around 40 degrees. So Treasure Valley, the next several days warmer than average will be topping off into the 40s. So just get ready for a very wet day to start the year on Wednesday. So if you have the day off, it's not going to be the best day to spend some time outside. We are looking at wet weather and traveling to and from the mountains could be very dangerous because we are expecting snow to be accumulating on those roadways. So it's just something to keep in mind for the day tomorrow. If you have the day off, just be prepared for that. Skiers are loving this. Yeah, we are expecting great. fresh snow at, at all the resorts starting tomorrow and overnight tonight. So yeah, it'll be a good start to fresh the year. Powder. Yep.